And now to a developing story out of Lauder Hill. That's where there's been a large police investigation happening for several hours now. CBS News Miami's Joan Murray is live near the scene with the details. Joan? Well, Maribel, this is where it ended, and it was a police-involved shooting, according to what we understand. It was quite a disruption for the people who live here in this neighborhood. It's just off 31st Avenue in Lauder Hill. They were woken up by the sound of gunfire. Before the sun came up, we heard from police the man who was shot had traveled here from Plantation, where he was in a confrontation with his girlfriend at a gas station on Broward Boulevard. So, according to police, he during the ride over here, he got he actually rammed a police vehicle. He gets here and then police say he had a confrontation with a police officer tried to take his gun according to police and then he was shot now we spoke to a neighbor about what she heard and saw i was woken up out my sleep by one of my children he said mommy mommy somebody got shot so i jumped up came outside he pointed me in the direction of where the person was across the street. They were laying down, face down, on the lawn, and officers was going back, back and forth, apparently trying to get him some assistance or something. He was already shot. Um, and that's but just about it. Now, according to police, the man who was shot was taken to an area hospital. He is alive in critical condition, and he is facing a lot of charges, including false imprisonment, kidnapping, aggravated battery on a law enforcement officer, aggravated assault, and fleeing and eluding police. In Lauder Hill, Joan Murray, CBS News, Miami.